Putin wants to expand the conflict zone. Oleksiy Danilov, Secretary of the National Security and Defense Council, believes that the incident over the Black Sea, during which a Russian fighter jet tried to intercept an American drone, shows that Russian President Vladimir Putin wants to expand the conflict zone and is going all in. The incident with the American MQ-9 Reaper UAV, provoked by Russia in the Black Sea, is Putin's signal about its readiness to expand the conflict zone with the involvement of other parties, Danilov said. According to the Secretary of the National Security Council, Putin is using an all-in tactic by constantly raising rates in the face of a strategic loss in the hope of a change in circumstances. It should be noted the U.S. Air Force issued a statement in which it was reported that a Russian Su-27 fighter jet damaged an American MQ-9 Reaper reconnaissance and strike UAV over the Black Sea during an interception, as a result of which the drone had to be sunk. The U.S. command stated that the MQ-9 was performing routine operations in international airspace when it was intercepted and shot down by a Russian aircraft, resulting in the crash and total loss of the MQ-9. U.S. President Joe Biden was informed about the incident, and the White House called Russia's actions dangerous, unprofessional and reckless. The Ministry of Defense of Russia stated that their Su-27 fighter jets had nothing to do with the crash of the MQ-9 Reaper American UAV in the Black Sea. In addition, they said it approached annexed Crimea and was flying in violation. The CBS TV channel reconstructed the incident over the Black Sea, during which the Russian Su-27 fighter jet tried to intercept the American MQ-9 Reaper reconnaissance and strike UAV. 